Hi, boys and girls. My name's Alice, Alice the astronaut. And today, I want to teach you about some of our planets in our solar system. Our solar system is made up of eight planets, and they all orbit around our home star, the Sun. I'm sure you've seen the Sun, right? Well, in this video, we're just going to learn about the four inner planets. The four inner planets are Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars. And the inner planets are the ones closest to the sun. These planets are smaller and rockier than the four outside planets that we'll talk about in another video. So let's get going. This is going to be a great adventure. The first planet we're going to learn about is Mercury. So come on, let's go. The first planet we're going to look at today is the planet Mercury. Mercury is the closest planet to the Sun. It is only about as wide as the Atlantic Ocean. It is also the smallest planet in our solar system. 18 Mercuries would be able to fit into the planet Earth. Mercury does not have an atmosphere, just like many of the other planets you're going to learn about in this video series. There is also no water on Mercury either. Mercury is so close to the sun that the daytime temperature on Mercury is a scorching 842 degrees Fahrenheit. But at night, because Mercury does not have an atmosphere, it cannot hold that heat, so the temperatures drop to negative 290 degrees Fahrenheit. Like all the other planets, Mercury orbits the sun, but its orbit only lasts for 88 days. It's a very hot crater type of planet, and its surface looks similar to our Earth's moon, which we'll learn about a little bit later on in this video. The next planet we're going to learn about is Venus, so let's continue. The planet we're looking at now is Venus. Venus is the third smallest planet in our solar system. Venus is the second planet from the Sun, and is sometimes called the sister planet of Earth because they are quite similar in size and gravity. Venus is the brightest planet in our solar system and can be seen even in the daylight if you know where to look. Venus spins backwards. What this means is that when Venus is west of the sun, Venus rises before the sun in the morning and is known as the morning star. When Venus is east of the sun, Venus shines in the evening just after sunset and is known as the evening star. The orbit of Venus takes about 225 days, so a year on Venus only lasts 262 days. Venus can be best described with two words, cloudy and hot. The entire surface of Venus is constantly covered by clouds. These clouds are made up mostly of carbon dioxide, which has a greenhouse effect keeping in the sun's heat like a giant blanket which makes Venus the hottest planet in the solar system. Even hotter than Mercury, which is closer to the sun. The temperature on the surface of Venus can get to 860 degrees Fahrenheit, or 460 degrees Celsius. That is a hot planet. The next planet we're going to learn about is our planet, Earth. This planet should look familiar to you. It's our planet. Planet Earth. Planet Earth is the third closest planet to the Sun, but it's the fourth smallest planet in our solar system. Our Earth is unlike every other planet in our solar system in a few different ways. The first way, it's the only planet that has an atmosphere that contains 21% oxygen. It's also the only planet that has liquid water on the surface. And the big one is, it's the only planet in our entire solar system that has life. That means any living thing, from people to animals to plants to fish and all that. The Earth is the only inner planet to have one large satellite moon. Earth is often called the ocean planet because its surface is 70% water. The distance from the sun to Earth 
is over 90 million miles away. And the average temperature on our planet Earth is 57 degrees. It takes the Earth 365 days, which means that one year on Earth is 365 days long. The next planet and the last planet we're going to learn about in this video is the planet Mars. So let's check out Mars. The final planet that we're going to learn about in this video of the four inner planets is Mars. Mars is the second smallest planet in our solar system. The red planet, as Mars is often called, is the fourth planet from the sun. And in a lot of ways, Mars looks a lot like our home. Though instead of blue oceans and green land, Mars is home to an ever-present red tint, a red color. This is due to a mineral called iron oxide that is very common on Mars' surface. However, when you look past the surface differences, our two planets, Earth and Mars, are similar in a lot of ways. Here are just a few. Mars has seasons just like Earth does. These seasons are much longer than the Earth's seasons because Mars is so much further away from the sun. And don't plan on getting your swimsuits out just yet. The average high during a Martian summer day is only 23 degrees Fahrenheit. That's what it feels like during the winter time. The distance from the sun to Mars is over 141 million miles away. Mars orbits the sun in 687 days, which means one Earth year on Mars is 687 days. Mars also has the largest volcano in the entire solar system called Olympus Mons. Mars is just like a desert, so you'll never see any rainfall as it's dry and cold. There's also not a drop of liquid water on the entire planet. We'd certainly get very thirsty up there. Thanks so much for watching this video about our four inner planets, which were Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars. In the next video, we'll be talking about the four outer planets and what those planets are all about. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give us a thumbs up by clicking that thumbs up button. And also don't forget to subscribe. We have lots of videos for you to learn and have fun. So thanks so much for watching. Take care. See you on the next video.